La Sierra is uniquely positioned geographically in that it is in Southern California. We don't have hard winters. We don't have burning summers. If you like to travel, we're only an hour and a half from Los Angeles International Airport. The metropolitan areas here are, are rich in culture, diversity, uh, ethnicity. This is clearly a cosmopolitan area in which you can be situated. The biology department of La Sierra University is unique amongst undergraduate students across this nation in that the undergraduates here have a tremendous opportunity to do research with publishing professors. I am a biology major and I emphasize in the biomedical sciences. And I chose that because that major pretty much sets up everything you need for to be, to be prepared for medical school. All of your first year classes in medical school will be set up for you if you do that major. I came to La Sierra to do all my prerequisites and I was challenged. Um, it was pretty competitive, but I, I learned a lot. And I think that I'm applying a lot of what I learned in dental school right now. Um, especially the first two years in dental school are really book years. And so uh, it's nice to have a really solid foundation science-wise to go into this. We're very, very excited to have a world-class group of working professionals coming and working with our students to teach them the skills that they need to succeed. They're trying to keep the, the film program here um, a certain size and keeping it, they want to keep it from becoming that big school pick a number mentality. But that's great because you get a huge portion of their attention. This program builds heavily on storytelling. That's yes. what we're all about. We believe that filmmakers are essentially storytellers no matter what position they are. They find themselves in within the process of, of what we do as filmmakers. And that's what, com what unites us all, is story. To me, music means the ability to connect with other people. Uh, no matter what their background, no matter what their life experience is, you can all connect through music, even if you don't speak the same language. And so that's one of the coolest things about the music department here last year. Because we're on such a diverse campus, the music department is equally di diverse. And so I've been able to play in groups with people that I know I might not speak the same language that they do, but together we're connecting through music and we're learning from each other. And it's a really cool experience. I've been in the honors program all four years. It's a great experience, and I encourage all incoming freshmen to at least consider the opportunity. Um, basically, we're just a close-knit family of creative, motivated students, and we just want to make a difference in the world around us. We want to be leaders. It's not restricted to a certain subset of learning. You get introduced to all areas of study. You talk about ethics and religion and politics and art. It's great. And you get so many connections, just the friendships that you make. Um, you'll get that in no other program. I just love the fact that La Sierra is so centrally located to many things. I mean, for my honors class, we've gone to performances in LA. Um, this week, uh, this Sunday, we're going to see Les Mis, for instance. And uh, we also are really close to the beach, which is great when you just need a study break or need to work on that English paper or get through that hard history book. It's nice to have the ocean crashing in the background. The archaeology program at La Sierra is really unique in the fact that it has one of the largest collections of artifacts outside of Israel. What that really means is that students who study here are given access to things that at Ivy League institutions they would not have access to studying the same subject. Our, I think our program at La Sierra appeals to a wide range of people, and not only people that are local, but students who come from quite far away. Uh, we look forward to increasing collaboration with, with other countries. Here, you're able to actually have a hands-on experience. You're able to discover not only about what the objects are and to discover the history behind the objects, you're actually able to touch and hold them. So archaeology at La Sierra is an experience that, while new and growing, is already one of the best you could choose to be pursuing. My main role is working on designing new programs and experiences and making sure the ones that we have are relevant to the real world uh, right now. So now you can attend TEDx San Francisco or TEDx Chicago. Um, and now today, TEDx La Sierra University. 
So after a, a two-year process working on this, we were able to, to obtain a license to hold our first ever TEDx Gloucester University event, and we called it The Possible. So we split the day into three main segments, imagine the possible, design the possible, and prove the possible. And we had 12 speakers selected from over 30 applicants uh, from all over North America, actually. At La Sierra University, we not only encourage our students to start their own businesses, we actually financially incentivize them. During the fall and winter quarters, we work with students on setting up a business plan. Actual business plans. We started probably a half a dozen companies in the past three years. What they do is they have an event in March called the Fish Bowl. It's a watered-down version of Shark Tank. Fish Bowl, things are magnified, and they're also transparent. So students make their presentations at the Fish Bowl event, and we provide funding up to $2,500 per student project. I've had a really great experience here in my, in my graduate program. Um, to be honest, I wasn't even going to uh, be in it, but uh, Johnny Thomas really, you know, he really convinced me to come back and, and I really wanted to be a part of this building because uh, when I graduated, I, I hadn't had a class in here yet. So I really wanted to experience this place. And a lot of people, they say, you know, usually go somewhere else for your MBA than you went for your undergrad. But with this new building, it pretty much is a new place. Um, my dad was actually friends with a guy named Walt Lancaster down here. And this guy had been teaching scuba diving for a long time. And uh, I found out there was a, a night scuba diving course on Monday nights. And I was like, this is, this is it. This is perfect. So started doing that, got real comfortable in the pool, did that sort of thing. And then by the end of the quarter, we were out in the ocean and uh, certified. So that was, that was a blast. The way that the university approaches spirituality is that it's part of your holistic being. So what would be so unique about a Christian university? The combination, it says, you know, these are not compartmental things. You don't just get your academics and that's by itself. You don't just get your spirituality and that's by itself. You are a spiritual being and, and who you are in God, it's just part of who you are. It's not just a section of who you are, it's all of who you are. You know, God is, a, is, is in everything that you do. So that's really what we're trying to do, you know, in, with the spirituality on campus. The thing that I like about La Sierra is that you can tailor make a lot of your education, a lot of your experiences to exactly what you want to do. So I wanted to go do leukemia research across the country and La Sierra helped facilitate that. So that's, that's, for me, is one of the huge positives of La Sierra. And one of, the, one of the reasons why I look back, I would say, would I go here again? Absolutely. People always say, oh, you're going to find the best friends of your life in college. And it's like, <laughs> okay. But I really found that to be the case here at La Sierra. Like, sure. I, I have met the most loyal, spiritual um, friends that I've ever had coming here to La Sierra. You got to have, have a goal. You got to have a specific goal. You got to have a... You gotta have a dream, you gotta be passionate about something. And then um, once you have that goal, you have that dream, then you have to kind of put it down on paper or put it in your mind and, um, and make it tangible. You just have to go for it. There's a time and place for nerves and being afraid, this isn't it. This is your college experience, this starts the rest of your life. And what you do here is extremely important. So be friendly and be fearless.